President Biden took the day off work Monday for some Columbus Day are and are in Delaware, along with a stop at a wedding nearby in Pennsylvania. Despite multiple ongoing crises that are tanking his approval ratings and threatening his agenda, Biden didn't speak with reporters when he returned to the White House in the late afternoon, despite fresh fears about slowing jobs growth, an illegal immigration crisis on the southern border and a spending fight in Congress that could define his legacy. Before returning to D.C., Biden tacked onto his long weekend what the White House called a small, family wedding at the home of his sister, Valerie Biden Owens just across the Delaware state line. Biden's nephew, Cuff Owens, is marrying Meghan O'Toole King, the White House said. King is a former reality TV star who appeared on the Raid All Housewives of Orange County. The president's approval rating slumped in polling results released last week, increasing Democratic worries about losing control of the House and Senate in the upcoming 2022 midterm elections. A Politico Flash Morning Consult poll found 52% disapproved of Biden's performance and 45% approved. Quinnipiac University found 53% disapproval and just 40% approval. Biden's approval rating was pulled down by a resurgence of COVID-19 cases and by the chaotic U.S. pullout from Afghanistan at the end of August, which left behind hundreds of Americans and thousands of us employed Afghans. Biden's frequent trips home to Delaware have raised eyebrows in part because the White House says it won't release visitor logs for Biden's Wilmington mansion or his Rehoboth Beach vacation home. He's spent at least part of 70 days at one of his Delaware homes since taking office, or about 26% of the days that he's been president. Biden's activities at home are unknown. His German Shepherd Major spends much of his time in Delaware after a series of attacks on Secret Service agents at the White House. As Vice President, Biden also was reputed to skinny dip while out of the public eye. Although former President Donald Trump frequently visited his Florida and New Jersey resorts on weekends, other presidents, such as Barack Obama, usually stayed at the executive mansion. As Biden left the White House on Friday, he was asked if he's concerned about potential corruption involving his son Hunter Biden's art sales, after the novice artist sold five prints for $75,000 each ahead of a Los Angeles art show attended by one of his father's ambassador nominees.